wanna talk no more about it in the past. Let's hit me up my song. I'm just talking come for the shy. I ain't give you nothing in my come for shy. I got plenty of days you wake up and for shy. I done had shit when he didn't lie for my body. So now, so now, I Hey guys, good morning. It is your girl Kanga Yama, popularly known as Kayom's darling. Oh, I act like I'm okay, but deep down, I just died. Had a killer session with my personal trainer, Rita. He's amazing, but yo, son, like every single time I'm working out with him, I'm like, I'm never coming back here again. I'm never coming back here again. But you know what? It makes me feel so good every time I do work out. Last week I didn't work out at all and I was having such a shitty week. Like, not a shitty week, but I just wasn't feeling confident. I was just feeling like, ugh, my energy levels were down. My diet was down because nothing was motivating me to like eat clean. So I'm so happy to be back at the gym. Um, yeah, I'm just waiting for a smoothie now and then I'm gonna make my way to the studio And then I also want to do some groceries. So while I'm there I'm just gonna put together a grocery list respond to some emails and um, Yeah, my computer is also at the shop which I need to edit last week's vlog so um, Yeah, that's pretty much what my morning looks like and yeah, let's see what we get up to this week. This week is a very busy week for me, but looking forward to it. And um, yeah, catch up with you guys later. So yes, hi guys. I went and did um, some groceries and I just thought I would give you a haul, a bit of a haul. First of all, I just want to start by saying the cost of living is just too high. Like, if I told you how much I spent on these groceries, you wouldn't believe it. But anyway, so I got um, quite. I'm like a convenience shopper. Like, I just like convenience. So I got this um, salmon, which I keep in the freezer. And very easy to make, quick and easy to make. I usually have this with mash throughout the course of the month. And then I also got um, this prawn meat, which is very nice and like a spicy rice or whatever. And then I got these um, this frozen um, strawberries and a smoothie blend with like some fresh fruit. And I also got a um, whole frozen blueberries as well. I then got some eggs. I buy my eggs at um, Pick and Pay just because I prefer to buy 30 eggs as opposed to like the 18. I find them to be ridiculously expensive at Woolies. So I just buy them in like 30s. And then I bought some toilet paper which I made, I made a bad call. I feel like this was a lot cheaper at pick and pay but anyway I was already at Woolies um, when I realized so I just bought the Woolies brand and then I bought um, these air fresheners actually for the studio but yeah and then I also got, I got this um, washing powder um, this is not really the one that I usually use, but I just got it because the one I used was just so expensive. Yo, guys, I was like, I wanted to cry, actually. So I just got this one. Um, yeah, and I hope it's going to be fine. Then I got some um, mango and orange juice. I love this. Got this from Pick and Pay. This is like my favorite juice. And then I got some um, olive oil, which cost 2 million rands still wanted to cry and then I got some vinegar which I use with the bicarb of soda and then I got some green peppers got a whole watermelon yummy and then I got these um, pizza breads I've never gotten these before but because they are freezable I, I decided to get them I love things that you can put in the freezer and use like throughout the course of the month a washing machine. 
And then I got these multi seed wraps. Because I usually buy the Woolies full chicken. And if you live alone, this is some great advice. Listen up. I usually buy this um, Woolies full chicken. And I usually have like the the normal pieces like the thighs and the, 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 the drumsticks and the wings and whatever and um, with the salad or rice or whatever and then I use the breasts in the wraps with eat manjeli do not eat scot you got my wrap okay okay anyway I usually put this in a wrap with some avocado some salsa and yeah, that's always like a good way to, you know, make some food. I also got some cans of baked beans, which I really like. I also got some cans of pilchards, which I also really like. And then I got this coarse salt. Then I got um, a dove. I usually buy the one in the six pack, but it being good. And then I got these um, Scotch Bright heavy duty kitchen sponges. I feel like these last longer than any other sponges. My mom buys these at home, so it's just something I just like got from home. And then I got, let's just move the camera because, hang on, think it is this. Then I got, um, what else did I get? Let me just tilt the camera. Yeah, and then I got um, some sanitary items. I love these um, panty liners um, just because I usually wear thongs all the time and they, the, I think I've spoken about these um, on my channel, they're like flexi style so this part at the bottom you can fold around your thong which is really really nice and then I got these always um, platinum, the, these are the ones that I like and the ones I use um, just because they're just good, I've been using these for years and I just love them. Then I got some sunlight. Um, I got some bleach. I got some window lean for my mirrors and my dining table. And then I got some handy andy. And then I got some domestos. And then I got these um, marbles. What are these actually? I got but if I wardrobe for like moths and stuff. Not that I have moths, but I actually just really like how it smells. So cotton moth balls. And then I got um, some macaroni, spaghetti, and then I got these pasta screws. Then I got um, some ginger biscuits. I'm working on this campaign with Amarula, so I thought it would be a nice touch to just like crush them and sprinkle them on the drink. Then I got parsley and mint. I'm also working on a campaign with... Um, lucky birds so i want to make like a mojito cocktail with this mint then i got this um russian ready to eat which just looked really good got some chili habanero cayenne and then i got these peppers i want to make jollof rice sometime this week so yeah and then i got some plums as well um some mayonnaise for the kosala <laughs> got some kosala so mayonnaise the kit kat i also got for my amarula campaign and then i also got some chicken gizzards yeah and then i also got some sweet corn i got some cucumber and then i got these um bacoma wheat bakes um breakfast biscuits which was sort of interesting again i like like convenient stuff so i was just like hmm let me try it out sometimes i want to snack on something before i drink my green tea just because hey green tea on an empty stomach stomach and giant party guys so i just wanted to try these for the first time and then i got some avocado some honey which cost two million rands yo um some kind of god and then i got this big bicarb of soda um for my white bedding and yeah, some of my gym clothes the scent like it's really hard to get out so i like to add this into my washing and then i got these microfiber cloths for the mirrors and stuff got some rice and then i got these um flake 
chocolates for my um what's this amarula content again and then i got um some tomatoes mushrooms crushed ginger and garlic and of course i got some summer edition red bull this cost two million rands don't want to talk about it but anyway and then i got some things from um yucky chef I want to show you got my computer back finally I need to start editing the vlog again I want to use this for my amarula content you gotta spend money to make money Sana like it just is what it is you know because they're so cute and aesthetically pleasing I wouldn't have gotten them just on my own I hate the gold <laughs> but I know they're gonna look really really nice and then I got these cute glass bowls again for my quant hands I used to have one of these I think it broke but I used to really like it and then I got oh this is like something that's really pretty that I got I got these cute coasters handmade in India I love these again I got this for my amarula content yeah now it's giving amarula it's giving taste of Africa. I also got these um, kitchen swabs. I don't know how I'm going to use them, but I also got them for my content. Just to place them. I also got the Earth Baby Spread for my bathroom. Then I got this um, these magnets from Yaki Chef. And then I got this. Pretty, pretty, pretty Verve Clico Smeg Fridge. But the bottle of Verve is that. Guys, I'm going to go to this. Guys, I love this. I got the shame. I wasn't even planning on buying champagne, but I wanted the container real bad. Ooh, this is also something I got for my content. I want you to sing into my cocktail videos. Sing tarela, sing it. And then, what else did I get? I got this knife. Love magnet. We got these magnets at the Akisha. And then I also got these cute shot glasses again for my Amarula content. Just because I love blowjobs and I think this would just make such a cute, cute blowjob shot glass. We have one energy now. We own. It would look really cute. Yeah. Love it for me. Yeah, that's pretty much all i got child the way like my life has been so unorganized but i'm getting it together okay i bought this kayon sign from neon feed and i still haven't used it still haven't put it up but we're gonna put it up right here and there's this plant that i was was in my living room that i want to put here now and then this um frame i want to frame all my covers and just put it down alongside this wall over here and um yeah i've got like a guy that usually just helps me put things up um here to to help me and yeah i think it's gonna look really really cute actually you guys are gonna see it because i want to start really really getting into filming and i just really like this room this was actually my guest bedroom but i decided to move things around a little bit and i just like that this is like a lot closer to my bedroom just because sometimes i want to wake up and like get straight into it even if i am getting ready for the gym i like sitting down and actually like getting ready. And so i just moved my guest bedroom in here and i'm just trying to put up this art that i had in my lounge up on the wall here you know i'm just really trying to get my life together I'm Take it, 
so I'm going to show you what my guest bathroom looks like at the moment. This rug really had to go and that had to go as well. In my old apartment the shower was like would get clogged up and stuff so I had to buy that piece of equipment but it's just not working in the space. I don't like it. And this is what my sink area looks like. As you can see I've just got a few random candles sort of just laying around here in an unorderly fashion and that um hand wash dispenser which I hate, I absolutely hate. I just feel like it has no riz, you know? And then I love this pampas grass, so I'm gonna keep this in here. But we're gonna like switch up some few things and just make it a little, a little bit more classy. There is um, some toilet paper there, but um, when it runs out, like I put it under the cupboard, which I didn't like, so I got something for that. And this is what um, the shower looks like. I mean, I hardly ever have guests, but when I do come, I want them to experience like a really nice experience. I have like a really nice experience here. So I'm going to throw away that old sponge and I'm going to put away that soap and get rid of this um, towel hanger. What I got, it looks just so good and it's just like so me right now. So luxe. I love this. So pretty. And then I also got um, um, this lush like just um, hand towel from at home as well. It's very, very soft, like very soft and luxurious. And then I also got um, this um, toilet paper holder um, diffuser and I got this very lush rug. Because honestly, sometimes like it's that feeling of stepping out of the shower. Yo, I love stepping on a lush, soft um, rug when I get out of the shower. So I got this big rug. Oh no, this is so big. This is a lot bigger than I thought. And then I also got a this fragrance spray. Just because I don't like having that air freshener vibe. So I thought this was just like really, really cute. So let's just have to see what this is gonna look like. Okay, final reveal time. I'm so happy with these very small decisions and improvements that I decided to make because they make like all the difference. Look at this pack of grass, get out of here. Okay, so this is what the red rug looks like. I mean, it's not so bad. I feel like it's fine. I feel like it's gonna get dirty quickly just because people are gonna step on it all the time. But I think it's nice the fact that you can stand here, wash your hands, still get a bit of, bit of the rug, sit on the toilet seat, get a bit of the rug, walk out of the bathroom, get a bit of the rug, and remove everything that was in there. And it just looks a bit more clean. All that I have is um, some, some body wash and a, a body scrub. And then, guys, I'm so happy. Look. This is what this area looks like now. It just looks so classy, you know? And then, final reveal. Yo, this looks so much better. I know I said I like I really like the pompous grass, but I was just like, mm, it's a bit of an overkill. I think the fresh baby's breath just creates such a, a nice mood in here. And now that I'm standing here, I feel like a piece of art would look really nice on this wall. Just a cute, like, minimal, like art piece or you know piece of art will look really nice so this is what it looks like and I'm so happy I made these changes the, that's the fragrance spray next to the hand wash I just put it on this side although I'm like I'm you know it's not a big deal but I just put it here just in case someone is like using the toilet and they realize oh my gosh I need a fragrance spray and they can just like easily grab for it and um, yeah this is the towel usually when I have guests over I put the bigger towels on their bed so they never in here in any case but um yeah i love this this is like my favorite part it just looks more it's just a better representation of like who i am and um the me the feeling or mood i would like my guests to like experience so yeah it's not that deep but it just looks better yeah so oh, this is what um, my kitchen cupboard looks like. I actually didn't give any thought to this just because when I moved in I just had a bunch of stuff that I didn't know where I would put. 
so I just put them there there's another open um, space in there and I just put those things there I hate how it looks in photos so let's switch that up t-shirt um, I'm starting like a tea collection thing you know grown woman things grown woman things so I got this um, cute um, tea holder thing and then I also got um, this gift of um, rooibos tea it's like it was like a rooibos tea collection thing that they were selling so I just got it because I was like okay this is gonna make sense for me it was also just giving like this it were great and then I also got what else did I get in here oh and then I got some cute teacups giving really classy baby and these are the sources that they came with I love glass um teacups it's just so beautiful the colors are just so vibrant and I also love the fact that it's supported like it's got a nook thing that let's go in because I am crazy is heel just look at that cute right and then uh, oh yeah and then I got this um, silicone ice ball just because I've got like a campaign that I'm working on for like this cocktail mixer brand. I got this for my car. Guys, this scent smells so good. If you ever go to at home, you need to get this for your car. Pear and vanilla, so good. So this is what I ended up coming up with. I am actually loving this. The flower thing is a bit uninspiring. I think I need something a bit more green. Otherwise, it just makes it look like very boring. I don't know. I mean, I'm not mad at it. I could live with it. Hey guys, good morning. I am off to the gym. I want to make some al glutamine. Hey, boy, I don't even have pre-workouts. But this is actually why I don't like not taking my never full. Because where am I going to put all of these things? Where am I going to put all of this? Hey. Hey. I decided to carry a funny pack. I caught a bag mailing in the course or in the course. I forgot everything I needed to take with me. I forgot pre workout, forgot my Apple Watch. I get to the gym, I'm like, oh fuck, I don't have a pre workout because I start drinking it as soon as I, like, I'm heading towards the gym. Man gets to sing a big, no pre-workouts. Man gets to sing a big, no Apple Watch. And the pre-workout was fine. I was like, you know what? I'm going to get like a coffee at the gym. And then I realized I forgot my watch. I was just like, what's the point of all of this? I'm literally so mad. I'm so mad because I was so excited to like get into my fanny pack era. Get into, you know. But really, really, like you know some things are just not for you and you just need to accept that like if any pack in Germany is not for me because I always have a lot of things to carry and you know what I'm never gonna attempt that again unless I'm going for a walk I'm never gonna attempt carrying fanny pack thanks it was cute and now I can't go to the gym anymore okay I can it's an excuse but I just got some coffee at Seattle I'm gonna do my makeup because I've got some content to shoot and then I'll probably just go for a hard go work walk Probably just go for a hard go walk after the work day. Because I actually got shit to do. I'm not working out the whole morning. Like, I woke up early for a reason. And you know what? Now that I can't go to the gym, it's okay. We move on. I'm moving on with my life. I have decided to just move on. A long day of shooting, it's time for dinner. It's giving 
it grow, it grow it around. Where's my seat? Where's my seat? Guys, <laughs> so I was supposed to go to the gym. I'm so happy I got to see my friend. She came to the studio to buy a wig and install it. And she looked so good. I forgot to show you guys the final product actually. Um, I just got back home actually. And I got my delivery from, I don't know how to pronounce it, Walk. 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 I got a few items when they launch their new spring collection. It's sad though because I got um, a small size just because I thought this mesh, which is a harder mesh, great quality, was the same as this mesh, which was like a thinner mesh. I've gotten um, stuff from them before and I got a large, so I didn't want to buy a large just because I know that it wasn't very flattering. So I just decided to get a small instead, but now this is too small and it doesn't stretch. So I think I'm gonna have to take this back. And then I've got their bikini with the green, so pretty. And then I also got their bikini bottoms as well. And then last but not least, I also got this cover up. I bought, there's a lot of things that I got here. Oh yeah, I got this cover up skirt, which is so pretty. And um, yeah, she included such a cute note at all. Um, she says, girls with makeup collections, we hope you enjoy your, pe your new season pieces package, especially for you. How sweet. Let me try this on actually and show you. I'm not gonna 